I just listened to the video of Let's Talk Bitcoin, uh, the philosophy of identity. Uh, justo he escuchado el video de Let's Talk Bitcoin, la filosofía de identidad, episode 160, episodio número 160. Later I will comment, later in, in my next video I will comment on this video. En mi próximo video voy a comentar sobre este video. But first I want to talk about the philosophy of Grumpy Cat. Pero antes quiero hablar sobre la filosofía de... Grumpy Cat, um, gato gruñón o malhumorado, humorado. Actually, these last two weeks I converted, uh, innocent crypto kitty converted into Grumpy Cat. Uh, en estos dos semanas, uh, um, Innocent Crip, yeah, yo me, me convertido un poco en el gato gruñón. Why? Porque? Because I had um, a tooth which was, which I had to get extracted. Porque he tenido problemas con un diente que luego tuve que extraer. Tooth extractions can be sometimes really complicated. Extracciones de dientes pueden ser a veces muy complicados. And I got a hole between the mouth and the nose. Eh, me salió un agujero entre la boca y la nariz. Then I had a look in the internet and they said um, you should avoid to blow your nose. Luego he mirado en internet y han dicho que hay que evitar de sonar la nariz. But just the next day after the tooth extraction, uh, my immune system was very low and I got a uh, very big uh, sneezing attacks. Pero el día siguiente después de la extracción de dientes tuve el sistema inmune muy bajo y tuve como muchos ataques de estornudos and one day later even the uh, I got even worse with uh, strong throat ache and all my left brain was hurting al día siguiente hasta Mm. empeorado y mucho dolor de garganta y todo mi lado izquierdo de cerebro estaba doliendo la oreja the ear was hurting okay one step back when before he the dentist extracted my tooth i told him please leave my brain in <laughs> gallows humor vale un paso atrás a poco antes de la extracción de dientes le dije al dentista por favor dejen dentro mi cerebro uh, humor negro <laughs> Okay, the throat ache got better, but um, I have still a phlegm obstruction.
a rest of um, influenza. Um, vale, el dolor de garganta mejoró, pero todavía tengo obstrucción con flema. And just yesterday I felt really bad because because of this like an obstruction um I got um vert I got a vertigo um se, justo ayer estuve muy mala que por es por el tema de la um, obstrucción que con flema conseguí, me vino mucho vértigo. Ok, this was yesterday, and a few days ago, this, uh, I went back to check, um, I went back to the dentist to check, uh, because mainly because of that hole and because there was like um and there is still like um a rest of the bone which was growing between the three roots of the t the tooth had three roots y bueno esto fue ayer y um unos días antes fui volví al dentista a chequear por el uh, agujero entre la boca y la nariz y también por uh, porque creció como un, re, un poco de hueso entre las tres raíces del diente. But what he did then, I'm really, really angry because this hole was already growing, uh, almost had cured, but the dentist, uh, he used one very strong air and it opened this, this hole again and it hurt very much. Uh, when you really want to slap someone, do it and say mosquito. I felt like one big, big mosquito is is pinching me into this injury. Bueno, um, pero luego me cabré de verdad porque el dentista, ah, esa herida, el agujero entre la boca y la nariz ya casi había curado, pero él usó un, un aire muy fuerte que se me abrió otra vez y me dolió un montón. Uh, por eso puse también esta, esta uh, imagen. Uh, si quieres de verdad um, bofetear a alguien, hazlo y di un mosquito. That's why I, uh, I say I converted into grumpy cat uh, por eso también dije ah sí est estos dos semanas me he convertido en grumpy cat um, do I don't want to know what love is and I don't want you to show me uh, translated is no quiero saber lo que es el amor y no quiero que me enseñes Sobre todo de esta manera como el dentista. Uh, especially how the dentist uh, <laughs> opened me this, this injury again. De abrirme esta herida otra vez. It really hurts a lot. Uh, de verdad ha dolido un montón. Because it really had already cured and <coughs> porque de verdad ya había curado casi y se me abrió otra vez then i won went on twitter a little uh, me fui a twitter but 
and actually I must say um tooth extraction hole in sinus cavity do not blow your nose extracción de diente in sinus cavity in agujero entre boca y la nariz um, no sonar la nariz Actually, the story is even longer. Uh, some years ago, I went to, uh, okay, translate first. En realidad, la historia es más larga. Uh, algunos años antes, I went to a dentist and she said, this uh, tooth has Pario, periodontitis. Me fui a un dentista y dijo que este diente tiene periodontitis. Period, periodontitis. And, uh, but actually I didn't have problems with that tooth. En realidad yo no tenía problemas con este diente. But she said she recommends me to extract it. Pero ella dijo de, que me recomienda de extraer ese diente. So I did it. Así que lo hice. But comparing now with this tooth which I got extracted just one, almost two weeks, no, one and a half weeks ago. Uh, pero en, en comparación a este diente que ahora he, uh, me fui a la extracción, uh, este diente sí me dio problema. This two, sí, yes, made me problems. But um, first they said, ah, this tooth is not so bad. Um, But ellos dijeron, sí, este diente no es tan malo. It seems they have a new philosophy to keep uh, as many teeth in as possible so they can make money with these teeth. It's, uh, parece que tienen una nueva filosofía de dejar uh, el máximo de dientes dentro. Ah, I must... I must um, I forgot to say before, um, when she said she recommends me, this was uh, the, the years before, when she said she recommends me to extract this tooth, she said this periodontitis can, um, can be contagious for the teeth around. Um, se me olvidó decir es en decir antes, uh, ella dijo estos a, a, años antes cuando me dijo, me recomienda de extraer este diente, me dice, um, puede ser contagioso para los dientes alrededor. So, But I have the suspicion she just said that because she was hoping that I buy um, implantation from her. Pero yo uh, tengo la sospecha que ella solo lo dijo pa porque tenía la esperanza que compro un implante. And in Germany it's very expensive, at least there. In Alemania, is, uh, justo en ese tiempo, just in this time I was in Germany, es muy caro, uh, por lo menos ahí donde fui. I remember they, uh, she asked, uh, said something like 3,000 euros. Uh, recuerdo haber oído algo como 3,000 euros. I got a shock, of course. Yo me asusté mucho, de verdad. So this time, uh, this they said, ah, this tooth is not so bad. Uh, and in one place, they didn't want to do that job. Uh, 
Entonces, sí, esta vez me dijeron, ah, este diente no es tan malo uh, y no querían hacer ese trabajo. I must say I had that problem because always the, uh, as you know, how is periodontitis the, uh, as the, um, as the gums, um, uh, are more low, the rest of the, um, rest of the food will always stay there and get in inflammation. Uh, sí, um, ya sabéis cómo las encías en periodon periodontitis están reducidos, los res restos de comida um, se acumulan y se inflama este sitio. And really several times, not just now, I had that problem already years with this place. En realidad ya años que a veces, not always, but sometimes, no siempre para, pero a veces siempre tenía esta inflamación. Así que me dije, fuera de este, este diente. Así que I said, get out from this, always causing me that problem. So anyway, uh, if if it's more much more justified to extract that tooth than years before that tooth that didn't give me problem es más más justificado de extraer este diente que el diente que hace años no me dio problemas so now just review uh, some tweets from twitter Uh, solo voy a revisar algunos uh, tweets from Twitter. This often causes problems affected wisdom. Teeth removal. This last um How can such a little tooth cause so big trouble? All in sinus. Rest of tooth. Uh, yeah, the bone uh, between these three roots. And in this context, teeth, tooth extraction. Uh, I had a little look at um, hashtag not funny, not funny teeth. So this belongs almost to my next video. This is, uh, I like that video. Actually this is, wait a minute. Yes, it's uh, when it's a Creative Commons video, I usually um, write, uh, mention it. Other, others I just retweet, but I like, uh, yeah, I have the old Twitter account and then I just copied and because the, the name appears in Twitter when it goes automatically, when I click on on YouTube, uh, bueno, debería traducir, I should translate, uh, cuando se hace clic en YouTube, um, hace automáticamente um, este, pero tengo otra cuenta en Twitter, so, um, it's Creative Commons, and it's, um, I put in, a Babylon is Fallen, and a filter of YouTube and yeah okay keep speaking English because anyway this video is in English normally I should be more disciplined but okay just reviewing here these tweets on Twitter so this belongs almost to the next video I'm going to do philosophy about identity I mentioned before 
on the new video of um, Let's Talk Bitcoin um, legal name. This was my video number 72. Next time I really should put uh, always and remember me if I forget <laughs> video number now as I did it here video number 79 Vanus Enigma I should make a separate videos reviewing the tweets because this is Okay, this is the video I mentioned before. I will comment on the next video. This is the comment I wrote. We should create a decentralized system of trust independent from legal name. Babylon is fallen. Truth, justice and JCCVW. Abbreviation for justice, court, comedy and virtual worlds. Another small comment. Not because he stole my cookie, but because he blocked cryptocurrency cat. Bitcoin dog blocked cryptocurrency cat. I want to remember that I'm convinced that cryptocurrency, for example, Bitcoin is the future of money. That's the main reason why I want to sell my apartment on Gran Canaria to have money to be able to invest. Estoy convencida que cryptocurrency, por ejemplo, es el Bitcoin es el futuro del dinero y que el valor va a subir. Es la razón principal por la que quiero vender mi apartamento en Gran Canaria. Tener dinero para poder invertir.